Drawing on our market-leading experience across the wide spectrum of cyber issues, Hogan Lovells convened senior legal, business and government leaders from the world's most influential organisations for our inaugural Cyber Summit on March 14th and 15th. In candid conversations under the Chatham House rule, we explored in depth the evolving roles and responsibilities of lawyers and business leaders in addressing the impact of today's cyber risks. The day and a half programme kicked off at Washington DC's historic Anderson House. Guests from a diverse array of industries began the evening by getting to know each other and test their collective cyber knowledge using customised personal iPads and a lively interactive exercise. After the evening reception and dinner, Hogan Lovell's senior advisor, former Secretary of the Navy and five-term US Senator John Warner introduced our featured speaker. Admiral Michael Rogers, Commander, US Cyber Command, Director, National Security Agency and Chief, Central Security Service, delivered a powerful keynote address and underscored the need for joint leadership and proactive measures to ensure data remains secure. It's another reason why I spent a lot of time with the private sector. As corporate leaders, let me just conclude with the last few thoughts. You must take ownership for this problem set. This is not a function that your CIO or your CISO can do for you alone. As a leader, and this is what the military culture teaches us, as a leader, you set the culture, you set the expectations, you set the priorities. Day two took place at Hogan Lovell's new conference space in our Washington office where participants and market leading speakers and session leaders tackled topics that included how senior management and board members manage risk in a dynamic environment, the interaction between business and government when dealing with cyber risks, and practical and actionable insights from the leaders who have prepared for or experienced actual cyber events. During lunch, Brian Krebs, investigative reporter and cybersecurity expert, shared his lessons from the underground real-life stories from the front lines of cybercrime. These guys have spent more than anybody in their, in their vertical on cybersecurity. It turns out they have. They bought, like, everything. And I think they just plugged it in. Um, the problem was, and those things that they had bought had actually told them that they were compromised. They just didn't have uh, the people in the seats to help them uh, make sense of all this data what these systems and technologies and software and services were trying to tell them about the, the integrity of their network. Later in the afternoon, Virginia Senator Mark Warner shared the Capitol Hill perspective. He spoke about how technology is outpacing policy and encouraged a public-private collaboration to address cyber threats across the world, emphasizing the need for a cyber-educated workforce. We are not going to be able to have a single silver bullet solution to it. It's going to require a change in business practices, it's going to require a change in governmental practices, it's going to require a level of, of sharing and collaboration that, frankly, public sector, private sector have not been very good at. Uh, because, as I'm sure Admiral Rogers shared with you last night, uh, this is a very much an asymmetrical threat. Throughout the day, participants took to their iPads as part of interactive polling exercises. They weighed in on today's top cyber issues, participated in live cyber debate, and helped guide the conversation in real time. The audience also played a major role in a simulated cyber attack, making critical decisions and managing risk to their businesses. Cybersecurity is top of mind for every general counsel and CEO across the globe. With the stakes increasingly high, these leaders must understand, prepare for, and defend against cyber threats. We saw the need to bring these top executives together on this issue and created a unique opportunity in our first Hogan Lovell Cyber Summit. 